is the Google Chrome plugin called the uh, Use Immersive Reader. Uh, it allows any user to very quickly use it to read text and all that. So I'm going to show you how you can do it in SLS. So in SLS, so let's say there's a particular text that you want to be read to you. You just select the text, do a right click and ask it to read to you. And it will run the Microsoft Immersive Reader app. You just need to click play. English After School is a series featuring interviews with people from a wide variety of occupations that aims to show the need for good English in different real world working environments. So this is pretty impressive. I think it's one of the best I've seen so far. You can actually even select uh, what are the nouns in the text, what are the verbs, uh, adjectives, and, and uh, adverbs. So these are pretty impressive features that I think you should get it installed in your Chrome so that you can run it in SLS lessons to get your students to try it. Uh, and you can even do for for students that need to focus on particular lines or paragraphs and you can actually do a picture dictionary so let's say you were to mouse over the words and it will show you a picture to show you what is environment the, what is the meaning of this word so episode you know it has a picture which i thought is is really uh really really good <laughs> And you can also choose to translate this to other languages. So perhaps you want to change this to Chinese. And you can select by word. Or you can select whole document, which then you can see on the fly the lesson is translated to that language. So it's a really neat and fantastic tool. Okay, so I'm going to show you now that we have seen how we can do for English I'm going to show you for a Chinese lesson so let's say we have a Chinese lesson and likewise you can select the text that you want it to be read to you so let's say you select this part and then you click on help me to read this And you just click play. So it's really, really uh, powerful. And the best thing is it's free. So you can take a look at it. Now let's try if this works for Malay. So let's say this is a Malay passage. Again, to invoke it, you say, help me to read this. Dia terjatuh tersandung batu. Correct answer kerana correct answer supaya. So I think the this English word is because I copied inside SLS, but I think generally you get the idea that it reads the Malay words accurately and with the correct uh, pronunciation. So let's see whether it works for Tamil. Right click, help me to read this. Pardon Sigul Paramuri Ponmuri Inia Todar Unatsi Todar Akiabate Inge Kartudar Pusayabam. So you can see that it does read very, very well, uh, if you ask my opinion. And it is free. So do take the chance to take a look at this. So you can actually change it to English. Uh, English so you can translate by whole document so it even helps uh, common people like me who don't understand Tamil to the song verse proverb and the sweet series of emotions are the comments here so you can see that this is a really powerful plugin all free so do check them out uh, to get the, the plugin you just have to install it uh, search for the word uh, immersive reader on website okay uh, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you can get the latest on some of these useful tips thank you